hey, this is Arshad from our intellectual property team at the United Lakes. We are here at the lab. Let's go take down iPhone 14 Pro. Let us unbox the new iPhone 14 Pro. A few noticeable difference is the rear camera lens housing that protrudes higher than the previous iPhone 13 Pro. The Super Retina XDR display has a ceramic protection and is brighter up to 2000 nits. It also has a new always on feature. The phone is tested by fully immersing in a beaker of water. And it still works. Removing the screws at the bottom of the phone and applying heat at the edges of the display to wear off the adhesive. The adhesive used appears to be stronger compared to its previous versions. The Super Retina XDR display is removed with a suction cup by wedging the display with a razor blade. And it still works. Removing the protective shield with the Y000 screwdriver bit. And disconnecting the ribbons to detach the display. The back of the display seems to have a driver and a controller for the display. Another protective shield is removed. And the front top speaker module is remote. The front camera module has a IR illuminator, a 12 megapixel front camera and an IR camera which has a 38% improvement in low light capture. The rear camera module has a second generation optical image stabilization with 49% improvement in low light capture. Removing the bottom speaker module with Philips 00 screwdriver bit. Removing the tactic engine with standoff screws. Removing the rear LiDAR sensor module. Removing a few ribbon connectors and removing the battery, which is 3200 mAh, providing one more hour video playback compared to its previous iPhone 13 Pro. Removing the 5G antenna at the side. Another 5G antenna is present on the stack boards like the previous iPhone 13 Pro. Removing the wireless charging module. Here at United Lex, we provide product trade-down services, product testing services, and IC reverse engineering services like construction analysis, circuit extraction, and material analysis. Please follow us on LinkedIn for more latest updates.